more often than not, people who can jump in and out of an emotion quickly can also jump back out just as quickly. But if your response is the wrong one, they can stay emotional longer than expected. Let them be themselves. So growing up from time to time, my father would always reiterate the same message to me. He would say, son, if someone is upset, you let them be upset. I even said this a few videos ago, a few speaks videos ago. But in this case, I want, I want to mention that and make reference to that in regards to this quote, because people don't want other people to be themselves. Some people are emotional. Some people are very quick to anger, but most of those people are also very quick to be in back to normal. My father was one that was quick to anger. It's okay, I'm, I'm okay. I ain't got no like childhood trauma and stuff like that, but he was quick to anger. I, I gotta call it what it is. He was. A lot of his family still is. I was at one point. You know, it's like a trickle down effect, you know, in the blood and whatnot. We ain't gotta talk about it. What I'm saying is, people didn't uh, allow him to be upset. And similarly, people don't allow other people to be upset. It's an emotion, a natural emotion. Let me be upset. Let me be this emotion. Let me be sad, even though it makes you feel uncomfortable, especially for my people that are in relationships. You need to let your partner go and feel their emotions. And if it's annoying you that they can just be, oh, he was just laughing, now you crying. Let, let them do it. It, it. Look at, look at, look at pregnant women. You know, they go, they, they are so hormonal most of them they, they they laugh and they cry and they get angry and they get sad and all these different things that's happened all at once in the space of like five minutes sometimes Trust me, I see. you just have to let them do it no contact for shock were found the heck however i could put it to you like this the bible say a soft answer turns away wrath but grievous words stir up anger so think of it as when someone gets emotional think of think of yourself as being someone that's at work especially in retail for those of you that work in retail and food you know exactly just how much stupidity exists in the world and how you kind of have to sometimes just just stand there or sit there and take it i understand that sir ma'am please if you can just and you just let them let them express themselves because I guarantee as soon as they walk out the store, sunshine and roses again. It's like it never even happened. But if you in turn was to cuss that person out, now all of a sudden they want to fight. Now all of a sudden they want to talk to the manager. Now all of a sudden they wasn't just mad. They now mad at you. And the Bible says so. So them dudes back then, they was writing about this stuff sound like they know what they were talking about you know what i mean I, I could be wrong they could be wrong you could be right if you disagree maybe maybe not probably not but you see my point point. and that's it that's all i gotta say about that it's 